In this problem, we have a car moving to the right. The car has a certain mass and a certain velocity, so we can calculate the momentum of that car. The other car is at rest, so when we add that to the original for the first car, we get the total momentum of the system before the collision. According to the laws of conservation momentum, the total momentum before the collision equals the total momentum after the collision. So we've got the total momentum before the collision. We click on this car. It will move toward the other car. They collide and stick together. And we'll be told their final speed. Since we have their final speed and we know the momentum, we can find the mass. Once we have that mass, that's the entire mass of the system. We could say that's the total mass for this system that was moving. From that, we should subtract off the mass on top of the one car, the 500 grams, which is the mass of these cars, and 500 grams for the mass of this car. <coughs> the mass remaining will be the mass that we're looking for, and that is the mass that's on top of the car to the right. 